Y'all tell me why I left my wallet in the car. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's your girl Maya. And thank you guys so much for joining me today. If you're new here, make sure you go ahead and thumbs up this video and subscribe to the channel right now. I'm gonna wait for you. I'm gonna pause. And make sure you go ahead and subscribe and turn your notification bell on so you can be notified when I post. And guys, today is a good day. Um, I spoke with you guys earlier uh, in regards to contacting the property place to see where they stand and, you know, more and stuff about the property and stuff. And y'all, I got to tell y'all something. This is how you know the devil is busy. Tell me why the person who I've been working with at the property management place to get the apartment, tell me why she no longer works there. So I'm just like, oh my goodness. So basically... I spoke to someone different today and I had to pretty much run her down everything that's going on and remind you guys, I'm really trying to get in before or around the 1st of April, you know, like being that Easter is coming up and you know, I want to be able to get in. So I spoke with her and basically she said, um, well, I, when I spoke to her, first of all, let's put this out there. When I spoke to her, I gave her a rundown of ever since I even been in the shelter. Like, I gave her a rundown of everything. I told her how, when I started there, even though that has anything, that has nothing to do with her, but I still told her that because I told her that I was praying on last week that, you know, this week I could be able to talk to the person I was supposed to talk to, which her name was Emily. And so I was praying all last week and, you know, praying fast and all this stuff. To be able to talk to Miss Emily on Monday, which she wasn't there on Friday. So I called, you know, I called Friday. She wasn't there. Then they said she's going to be back on Monday. So called Monday and she's not there. And so then today I called her. I called and they said basically she's no longer working there. So I don't know if she quit or she got fired or I'm not sure. But all I do know is that I've been working with this. She, this lady's been working with me trying to get me in. And now, basically, I had to tell my story to the next lady, you know, and I really stayed, I stayed on the phone with her for at least 10 minutes, just blah, 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 just trying to get her to understand, because she was trying to rush me off the phone a little bit, but I was trying to get her to understand the the process of what's going on. Basically, it's just like a lot of hold up. There was things in the house that needed to be fixed, and the inspection is it's so much so much like I don't understand why it's really happening to me but it's happening so basically the lady don't work there anymore which I don't know might be a good thing because she was kind of giving me a hard time telling me she's gonna call me back in the middle of the week and all that so I basically told the lady everything that I could tell her like literally like basically begging her to not begging but I'm you know I'm letting her know that I need her to call me back and I need her to let me know I need her to send me an email I need her to call me to let me know when the next step so I can be on my part to do what I have to do on my end. You know what I'm saying? So it's a lot going on dealing with this inspection thing. And I'm really, 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 really like this close. Like that's the last thing. I'm on the last thing. So I know I'm going to be patient and everything and wait. But I just wanted to come on here and let y'all know like that's the updated news on the apartment. So I'm just waiting for not have to basically get in good with the next property manager like the property manager i'm dealing with quit or got fired or whatever happened she doesn't work there anymore so it's like it's weird because like it happens like when i me out of all people am trying to do something it happened you know and then the lady who i was talking to emily she was like very uh like sarcastic about things you know what i'm saying she was very sarcastic about things and like kind of like she's tired of doing the same job over and over again you can tell like that's how kind of how her energy is and you know it was probably good or meant for me to talk to somebody else you know what i'm saying because you know it was it, she was trying to get she was trying to tell me to be patient and this and this and this but with this person that i spoke to this you know this morning she was just like you know okay basically she's just going to give me a call whenever this go through or 
she's gonna give me a call she's basically gonna let me know she said if it's not today then it's, it'll be tomorrow and at least she's letting me know like dates you know what i'm saying so i'm happy about that so i'm just waiting i put up at the store so let me go in here and i'm gonna come back Hold on. all right guys so i just came and i made it to walmart i'm about to go in here and see if i can get me another um i don't know if it's tmi or not but another bra because i need another bra and that's really like the last major thing that i really need because i don't want to be spending a lot of money so i might like to come in here and get a bra and leave, literally leave out with just a bra seriously like i'm not trying to spend no more um than what a bra costs so i'm about to go in here and get my bra and i'm gonna take y'all with me let's go Okay guys, these are the bras that I'm looking for. Now I'm about to just try to find my size. And hopefully they got black. Let's look down here. Um, let's see. Okay guys, I found two of the same sizes and one of them is black, one of them is like cream. So of course I'm gonna go with the black. Got the goods. Mm. Let's check out what's down here. I'm going to the self check out. Y'all tell me why I left my wallet in the car. I got my wallet and I'm like going back in here. That's crazy. I think I'd be moving too fast. Going back in here now all right guys i'm happy i was able to get what i needed from walmart and now i'm on my way back to the job because you know i have an hour break but coming here it's kind of almost about 30 minutes of the break so i gotta hurry up and get back and get back to that side of town you know what i'm saying and then maybe i can get some food but i really just try to like not spend as much money you know what i mean because i'm definitely trying to get into this place and be able to have my part of the down payment and stuff like that so not down payment but the security deposit you know what i'm saying but yeah guys i just wanted to let you guys know what was going on and keep you guys updated um because y'all pretty much are gonna know everything and i'm gonna make sure i let you guys know and keep you guys informed on the process and how this is going so with that being said uh, i know this is like not a long video but i still just wanted to put this out there and just you know keep y'all updated but thank you guys so much for tuning in with me today um i appreciate all the nice comments and the kind words and yeah you guys we going up and to my new subscribers make sure you go watch some previous videos so you guys can um get updated on what's going on what's happening like right now you know so yeah um i'm gonna catch y'all in the next video i holla good morning guys welcome back to another video um it's your girl maya if you're new here make sure you go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel thank you guys for tuning in with me today today is a good day um i'm heading to work right now and it is currently raining as y'all can see it's definitely raining out here and it's slippery and wet so you know that's kind of a bummer but we're still smiling on the inside you know we still gotta have a good day we're still gonna get some money we're still gonna be on the clock so we gotta get that money and yeah that's pretty much it um right now i'm just happy to be able to work at a job where you know it's not really much you know it's not too hard you know i mean i pretty much you know i'm a lead teacher so i'm pretty much in there doing a little bit of everything and i'm just happy to be able to like 
you know, have a job and, you know, make some money from, you know, from this. And I'm going to be, like I said, I told you guys everything that pretty much happened with the property manager people. And today it's just going to be a day where I try to call back, try to make sure things are getting like, you know, done instead of being prolonged. You know what I'm saying? Just because somebody quit or somebody don't work there no more doesn't mean that, you know, things can't, you know, speed up in the process. So I'm excited about that. Um, hopefully, you know, no one says that, oh, it's raining, so they don't want to do their job. You know what I mean? Hopefully everybody is, you know, accounted for at their job destination, you know, Hopefully everything goes right. Just because it's raining it don't mean that don't mean nothing. It don't mean nothing. So yeah, I got I got this dang on wrinkled shirt on. But it's okay. You know, it, like I said, I'm not really going to impress nobody. You know, I'm just going to be around a whole bunch of kids. So it's not a bad thing, you know. But I'm excited about today. And it's not gonna rain forever. So, you know gotta look at the we gotta take some good with the bad and i'm just hoping and praying that everything works out um today i probably uh try to wash a load of clothes i have some white clothes like some white shirts for the girls that they wear at school that i want to wash along with some towels so i'm gonna have to try to get some bleach and wash those clothes and yeah i'm just trying to stay productive all day um move around i got this uh thing on my phone where it's like a fitness app you know you try to lose you lose as much calories as you can lose that day so i'm trying to do that I'm trying to stay on my calorie count and you know just be able to try to lose some pounds yeah because i was looking at some of my old pictures around the time where i used to stay here and i uh I used to juice, and I used to do it like every day. Like I used to just be motivated to doing it. It's okay, baby. And I also even used to. Um, there was this, um, like coffee. I used to do coffee lemon and a shot of uh, vinegar, and I used to drink it every morning, and it made me like extra, extra, like moving around and stuff like that and that helped me out i think it burned a lot of little fat and stuff like that so i'm gonna start doing that whenever i get my place i you know i'll start doing that uh, my coffee maker is also in storage so i gotta get that but i'm excited because like i i, I started thinking like oh and i actually spoke with miss uh, the lady at the place today miss hood i spoke with her inside the center today when we was eating breakfast and she was just asking me what's the um she was just asking me what's the process and what's going on and stuff and then I was just like basically telling her what happened and then she was just like you know it's okay you know just wait till you know we'll just wait for them and then you know you know at least you have somewhere to go you know while you waiting you know what I'm saying so that was a good way to put it you know but I don't know if I told y'all but I realized that it's a lot of stuff in that in that um, center that can't really get out because there's no windows. You know what I'm saying? So whatever is passed around and stuff in there, like it's just I don't know. Like, but I also thought that it's a good way to build your immune system for you to not get sick. You know? So that's what's going on. Either way, um, I'm gonna come back and talk to y'all a little bit later. And yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the content um like i said it's rainy and whenever i get situated i'll be able to post you know different kind of content for you guys i just want you guys to share if you know anyone that's going through the same thing like me you know just just spread the word and the only what the only reason that i'm able to upload like daily or every other day is because i choose to make the videos and then upload them whenever i get to my job so otherwise it wouldn't be otherwise it wouldn't be every day or otherwise it wouldn't be you know like it's a lot like i don't have internet on my phone um i don't even have storage on my phone so i have to pay for storage and not only pay for storage i have to 
literally delete things in my phone like good pictures bad pictures i had to delete everything out of my phone in order to you know actually um have room and space enough to record these videos so that's why some of the videos be kind of short because not a lot of space on my phone so we're working on that um storage costs 2 dollars on my phone so you know i just be paying for it sometimes here and there trying to uh, build up some more storage for what i have but yeah i'm gonna come back and talk to y'all later because you know baby girl back there singing and everything so later